Hi, this video I will scan a black object with a CR scan otter. This controller has a matte black and some gloss black and uh, some button with a transparent. It could be very challenged for scanning. I will scan in geometry mode without uh, the marker. Because the object is very dark, so I have to adjust the exposure manually. I will adjust the scanner distance from the green point cloud. I found that the uh, optimal distance, um, the, the green point cloud is very uh, small amount. But uh, if I step uh, a little bit further in a, in a good good range, not the optimal one, uh, I get the best uh, point cloud. Here if I move too close, the point cloud disappear, and if I move back, the point cloud will come back. At the beginning of the scan, I will aim at the edge of the controller, which has a more curve. And in the center, it is more flat. So I scan around the edges first. This is the glossy part which is uh, difficult to catch. Now I'm uh, connect the scanner to my desktop and I can get a speed around 30 frames per second with the CR scan author. And if I connect uh, the scanner to my other laptop, uh, I get only uh, 7 frames per second. It would take more than 15 minutes to uh, do the same scan on, on my laptop. As you can see here, it's tracked very fast and it only takes a, a second to align the model. This is the first time that I can successfully scan this a black controller without a spray and the markers. This scanner is uh, considered to be very easy to scan. Yeah, even the object is black and glossy. I can scan this uh, in one go. There is no merging, no separate scan. But you need to have a fast PC, um, fast computer graphic card to achieve this uh, scanning speed.
Okay, now every part of the controller is in green color, so it has enough uh, information. Uh, so I will process the point cloud. I choose zero point two millimeter resolution. There are some left over um, point clouds that need to be cleaned up, uh, but uh, overall it looks very nice. One point three million points. I will mesh with a uh, maximum resolution. Which give me 2.7 million faces. Now we can take a look at the result. The glossy part here uh, on the trigger, left and light button. Uh, it it uh, come out very well looks a bit rougher than the other part but it can be scanned without any spray and the result is very good for infrared scanner the transparent button ABXY looks a bit uh, mushy I made some sport under the sticks